After dozens of years of writing books and doing large workshops of men and women trying to get them to understand each other, I found that everyone had a common Achilles heel, which is our inability to handle personal criticism from our loved ones without becoming defensive. When that problem is conquered, um, the couple is able to free themselves to love each other more deeply and not be afraid of communication, but rather to invite communication. The focus of my couple's communication work is what I call the art and discipline of love, is to teach people how to feel safe while they're receiving the criticism, and not only feel safe, but to emotionally associate that criticism with a deeper opportunity to be loved. All of the work of the workshop is done by each person communicating only with their partner after I've given them instructions as to what to do and how to do that. Because I see almost every couple that walks in there on Friday walk away more deeply in love on Sunday, even if they came preparing to get a divorce, even if they had been working on this as a last ditch effort. And that is the magic of the, of the Couples Communication Workshop. Our uh, first introduction to Warren Farrell's workshop was through my daughter Emily and her husband Sam, who had attended one in New York State and were so appreciative and one said, Mom and Dad, you must come to one of these workshops. We've gained so much insight and our communication is so much better. I think we came <clears throat> uh, feeling stuck, both of us having good ideas about what we needed but not really able to communicate effectively with each other about those needs. There's been an internal shift for me. There's this confidence that I am loved and that this relationship is worth uh, pursuing and deepening. I think for myself that um, the opportunity to uh, experience things differently uh, to both of you, my own experience of what's happening in me and to hear Jill's story and experience too and to share that together have been very, very helpful. For me to um, think positively during the day about appreciations, uh, ways that I appreciate Mitch and uh, things that I can do to enhance that. Uh, to create happiness for him as well as myself. Well, I'm a clinician and I've worked for 30 years with couples. And I would say, even from that perspective, that it's been a very rich, rewarding uh, experience for me personally uh, in my growth and uh, in my relationship with Jill. And I would recommend it to anybody without the qualification. I have like two or three couples that I, I want to say, um, please go, you must go. You know, I, um, it's going to be life-changing and so encouraging for you.